Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. So as you can see, I just put the stock, not stock, but the original spoiler I had on, which is the carbon fiber ducktail. So I decided to put this back on because after a while I was like, you know what? I think I'm gonna settle down and go back to um, more of the low key look versus the big giant spoiler. So if anyone's interested, I have a Black Series replica spoiler for sale. As you can see here, it looks really good. I actually put it right on top of the dip. It's holding pretty well. I don't think it's gonna fly off. I'll probably fill these holes with some silicone. Um, I'm not too concerned about the look because I'm actually gonna vinyl wrap over this anyways. With that being said, today we're gonna vinyl wrap my car. Um, I've already made the design. We're gonna go upstairs and take a look at it on the computer and I'll walk you through the whole entire process. I'm super excited. There's a lot of people that's really excited on Instagram as well because I've been kind of throwing these little sneak peeks, but let's get to it. So the first thing you wanna do is take a few pictures of your car, the side, the top, an angle, and then you wanna upload it to a computer or you wanna print it out on a sheet of paper. So once it's in your computer, the next thing you want to do is actually draw your design. Um, when I put it up to Microsoft Paint, all I do is go to this polygon tool and make sure the outline is solid, the fill is solid, and let's say that I'm doing black, so make sure the outline color is black and the fill color is black, and just basically snap what you want and then you can just do that whatever color you want so I decided to do white gray and black and once you're ultimately done it can look like this so I took all of this and I actually sketched it on a piece of paper and you can see the G is for gray the W is for white the B is for black I got the side profile I got the angle profile and you can do this freehand like this, like I did, or you can print up the picture and actually use a pen and then draw on the picture itself. Um, once you have this done, um, I'm gonna take a sheet of paper, mount it up to the car, draw in these lines, and then cut, them, cut out the pieces individually and transfer them to the vinyl wrap. Just finished washing the car, it's nice and clean. I didn't put any dip coat on it or top protection or wax because we need the vinyl to stick really well. But in the meantime, I wanna talk about Plasti Dip. So Plasti Dip or Dip, when you spray it, make sure you put on more than enough coats because it's gonna be a pain in the ass to peel off if you don't. And here's a good example why. Brother and his proud control Mustang GT, he decided to rattle can dip his GT logo. And you see that? Pain in the ass to take off because he only put on two or three coats. You should put a minimum of at least five or six coats. But luckily we have dip dissolver. This you spray right on, let it sit. You can hose it right off and use a microfiber towel and rub the dip right off. Just make sure you don't get it on black plastic trim. So lesson learned. <laughs> So now that the car is taped off, as you can see, I did most of it. I'm gonna give it a shot, do some, maybe just a door for now. See how it looks, see how it feels. If it turns out good, I'll proceed to doing the rest of my design. Okay guys, what do you think? So far I got the nice outlines. I got my different color codes, B for black, W for white, and G for gray. So let's go inside, cut these out, transfer them to the vinyl, and then let's put the vinyl on. So this is the vinyl wrap. Since my dip job is kind of a satin look, I decided to go with a satin vinyl. Uh, these are all 3M high quality 1080 um, vinyl wrap. I got these on eBay. I think I have a five, 
five by five, five by five, and five by five, each for around forty, fifty dollars. It's enough to do about half of my car, which I wanted to do on purpose because I wanted to see how it will come out. But let's see. Okay guys, I have all the vinyl wrap pieces. Now it's time to do the install. Hey guys, the wrap job is done. Here it is. Oh, wait a second, wrong side. Give me one second. Here we go, here's the wrap job. Tell me what you think. Time for some beauty shots and I'll see you next time.